Hey guys, you're watching Super One and Only. My name is AJ. Welcome back to the episode of Let's Build a City, episode 351. Last episode was 350, so it was a world tour. If you're new and you missed it, I recommend going back because you get to see a pretty good overview on uh, a lot of stuff that we've done. Tried to do a little bit different again last episode, like I, I always try and do each world tour, and we visited the places that we don't really visit all that often. Today, though, Episode 351, we're back to work and we're working in the night time today. Before we start though, how cool is that moon glow behind that skyscraper? Like it even moves, like like how cool is that? Like the glow around the how the how the moon's light sort of shines on it. Really cool. Really cool. And then it goes into the next one. I never spend enough time at night time. Enough time at night time? Yeah, it does make sense. But yeah, boy, does it look cool. So, a lot of people were saying last episode that they I should have uh, showed you guys in the night. So, uh, I'm showing you this episode in the night. And uh, a couple of people recently, actually, over the last sort of few episodes, were saying, you should really go around at night and put a load of lights on the building. Now, we'd done it about... <laughs> About two years ago, uh, and we lit up sort of uh, everywhere. But I thought, you know what? It probably is time for a nighttime update. We don't do it enough, and it's it's actually a really important part. Like, like see why all these buildings are all lit up? It looks great. And you get to these skyscrapers at the back, and, and there's nothing on that building. There's nothing. We just always have to have the glows going. Like, like it's so important around the Tiki Hut there. Like, it, it makes such a, a massive difference to any build. Just getting a little bit of light, which is why on some of the, the houses, I've put, like, lights just behind, like, one of the windows. Like, we'll do it down here, look, on this building here. If we go in here, we'll get grab ourselves some, uh, some glowstone. By the way, how cool is that? The shade is actually sort of, the glowstone is in my hand and it actually lights up. Very cool. I might even just do it on that one, and then we'll come around here. I'll do it on that, this one, like that. Do it on that one. Can't really do it on that one. I always put them above, so it's a little bit harder to um, see if you're on the outside. So obviously, it's not it's not a pretty pretty way to do it. Yeah, I think that might do. I think that's enough. So uh, I fell. Come back out the way we came in. See, it just it brings so much more. Just that one light. You don't have to light up everything, but just like look, a few little lights around the place makes the building look so much more alive. Like it's late at night. Most of the people here have gone to bed. There's no windows in the bowling alley, so we can't really do too much with that. I suppose we could put some lights on the top somewhere, but in general, yeah. Really cool. Even the boats have some lights on there. I don't know if we should do this in a in a strategical way or or, or, or anything like that. I'm not sure. Let's do the uh, inside of the university here. Like, do we go like across the city, like left to right, and and and, and try and hit everywhere, or do we just sort of do what we see? Like that. And this part. If we're going to do the university, then we need to do the, the whole of the university, though. And eventually, I suppose eventually we'll get around to doing doing everywhere. There's not too much more um, exterior stuff to actually build anymore in the city. So we, we, we've filled up, like, loads of the area. Um, so it'll give us more time to be able to do things such as this. That one. That one. I'm not going to back off and have a look until I've done the, the whole university here. There's only, I think only one building left, maybe. Something like that. Okay. What was that? <laughs> four. Four more. Um, I'll be back. Okay, I don't mind uh, going around different buildings. I'm sure you guys don't mind seeing different buildings being uh, lights added, but these are all sort of the same sort of lights and stuff, or the same sort of interiors, so uh, it's a little bit boring to watch. But how cool is that? How cool is that? Boy, it's so cool. Okay, um, oh, where do we go? Let's do the farmhouse. Let's do this corner of the world here first. Um, got a little bit of light on the bottom there, a little bit of light in there. 
Are those lights on there? Uh, are, are these windows there? Yeah, I think if we if we try and strategically do this, if we get a quarter of the map done today, um, I'll be really happy. They are windows. They're just a little bit weird. How they're... I don't know why. Oh, probably because I would have... Um, uh, that's a solid white in there. That would be why. There's no... Uh, there's, it's not a hollow building like, uh, like I would normally do. Makes such a difference though. This should probably work through the night as well. Put them a little bit higher. Get a little bit of a glow going on there. Cool. Do anything down here? Anything more? Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. We can do them in here. Where are the doors to these areas? Are they under here? Nope. Are they on this side? Can we even get in here? Are there any doors? There might not be any doors. We'll make a door. A door has been created. <laughs> okay. So I try and spread them out, but sometimes I do like two next to each other. Uh, like it's a big room. Like it's the same room sort of thing. Uh, yeah, here. I'm going to block that back off. Oh, man. It, it, like you can't not like that. It looks so good. So this one has windows on the bottom half instead. Very rarely be able to see this, I think, but. Not along here. You probably don't need five blocks either. You could probably get away, probably even get away with one, to be fair, because they're all right next to each other, but we'll do it anyway. Okay, that doesn't have any windows, because that's like the launch one. This doesn't really have any windows either. So I think we're, we're it doesn't have any windows. We're pretty much done here. Why does that look like it bulges out so much? What a weird... See how that, it looks like it's like rounded, doesn't it? Really weird illusion. It's not, because you can't do that in in uh, in Minecraft. Okay, what if we go through here? Let me in. Um, okay, we'll do that here at least first. Okay, and why can't I get into the cockpit? What have I? I want to get in. I want to do it. In, I need to do it in a way that isn't like completely destructive. Okay, I'll remember that. I can remember that. And then it was that one, that one, that one. Yep, cool, love it, nice. Now, back over to the farmhouse. Um, don't want any lights in the fields. Wouldn't make sense. I like that being dark. A little bit scary at night time. Looks like there's a little bit of light going on in the... Yeah, a little bit of light going on in there. We'll leave that how it is. And the farmhouse. It's a huge place. What a, a, a absolutely massive building this is. Crazy size. So I'm just picking window windows completely randomly. Whichever ones take my fancy. I think I'll do. I think that's good. And is there any windows in the garage? There is, but I don't think anybody would be in there this time of night. Okay. Uh, I don't think there's anything really at the water treatment plant. Not any windows in those buildings and stuff. It wouldn't make sense. The airport. I really want to get those, um, you know, those those things that like the planes know if they're too high or too low, and they're like uh, they're like giant red lights. And if you're is it if you're too low, they're red, and if you're too high, they're white. I think that's sort of how it works. I think not quite sure, but yeah, probably need some more some more lighting around here in general. To be fair, but not quite sure how we're going to do that yet. Okay, so let's hit. Let's go back over here. We're, we're, we're going to go across the world like this. and try, try to do it in a way that I know if we end the episode off and do all of it, I want to be able to carry on 
down the line and, and pick up from where we left off. That's, that would be the, the best way to do it. Very nice house. This is like a little world tour for you, us as well, though, isn't it? Like, we get to see uh, more of the more of the buildings that we couldn't see last episode. So it's like, oh, it's like a, a mini world tour. A, mi a world tour with a purpose. A world tour with a purpose. Always weird seeing the insides of, like, unfinished houses. Like, you see, like, little how the exterior works like that block needs to be there but it's just weird to see it on the inside okay uh that one's got lighting on the outside so we can leave that one this one is uh, uh i suppose i could put them down on these little windows couldn't i at least we until we do an interior like if i ever get around to doing an interior to this building i can then remove these if we need to oh it wraps around very nice. Does it make a difference, does it? Oh, it really does. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah, very important. Okay. This one here. What is this building? Do you even know what this building is? Oh, yeah, I sort of remember what this building is. Ah, oh, man. Um, I can't get in. It's not a great start. Let's extend this up. We'll then extend this up. And now we can get in. Yeah, I sort of remember, like, I remember living, like, the person can live upstairs and work downstairs, like, like, like how, that's how it sort of works. But I can't remember what the building was actually meant to be. Quite a big building, but I can't remember what it was actually meant to be. Okay. Um, where do we go from here? Let's go, let's go from here and around that way. So this is the, uh, the clothes shop. Again, if there's not many windows, we can get away with it being darker. Oh, there's, no, there's light on the bottom half. There's light in the shop part. It's just not on the, uh, the empty floor there. So I can leave that. This one. A bit of light behind there. A bit of light behind there. I think I'll leave that one dark. And this one here, we'll get back to some lighting. I also love the uh, the middle part of this area as well, how it's got like a little cut-in part. We'll, we'll, we'll go through there, I think. These windows are just where we've filled the building. It's not actually windows. Oh, it's a tall one. I didn't quite realise that. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. That'll do. Oh, yeah, yeah, look at the middle here. So, like, you've got a little loading zone and stuff for the wagons when they come through. Ah, can I get any lights in these ones? Do these go anywhere? Why did I not go in here? Did oh, it was just the one that I said I was going to leave this one blank. Is that why? Great idea though to to do this. Uh, do this one. It's not easy to get in the blue and places though. Ah, um, I do have to do that below it. This is the other side. Fill in the fake door. I just not look up when I came in here. I must just not have looked up. That's what it would have been. Yeah. Okay. Oops. Oh, so many of them. Let me do this area. I'll be back again. Okay. So I've done this side as well. Little commercial district with all the uh, the shops here. If we go into this middle part now. There were so many windows there, crazy. But all the uh, all the buildings are hollow, so you could just walk through them all. So it didn't actually take all that long. I was quite pleased. Yeah, feels good. Even the lights down here and stuff. And then if we fly over to this side, again, they're all lit up over here. 
Man, I can't stop looking at it. It just looks so sick. And there's enough distance like between like that window and that window to know that that light is on and that light is off and it's just like reflection and stuff very very cool very cool okay let's do the housing area next so we'll come down here most of the doors we can just walk straight through as well which is nice bink bink oh yeah that one for sure. We've got a little uh oops window that's open here as well. Nice. This one I think most of these have already been done. Might have even been done when we initially built them, because I know at one point I was trying to do it as I went. Um and then I, I sort of forgot. <laughs> it's a, sort of my bad. Yeah, it's the other one. Very strange building that one. Nice, but just a bit strange. Yeah. Oh, it's so cool. Okay, uh, down here. Uh, that one's got a light on the front. Does it have any windows at the back? Yeah, it does. We'll do it then. I think I can cut down the amount of glowstone that I'm using as well. Like if I'm doing an odd numbered one, I think I'll just use one on there. Oh, little, little land building as well. Little conservatory on this one. Here, really nice house. This one, I just like the the whole shape of this one. We uh we actually came here last episode and had a look. Trying to get as many different heights and stuff as we can. Always we'll stand back and have a look. Got that one already. This one isn't. Very nice house here as well. Plants out front always make a difference. Made a little change there as well with the um, the pressure plates. That one. It's a little thin area. It'd be like a nice little bedroom. That's a bathroom for sure. Bathroom style window. Yeah, we'll do that one. Look, that's the window. That's not the way out. This way's the way out. Eh, we'll get that one. Can I get that? Is that it's not accessible. Okay, fine. Fair enough. It's raining again. Where they're clear. Uh, primary school. I'm actually going to leave the primary school dim. It's night time. Nobody's going to be there. Wouldn't actually make sense. Okay, got another sort of little estate here again we might be able to get away with just going in one of the buildings or are these actually are these might be uh, all closed off like last time in the in, in the other building i could just go through here and uh it, it was open but uh in this one it's not oh i got rid of the glowstone glowstone It looks like there's buildings on the back here as well because there's no windows on any of the backs of these. Okay, that's been done on the ground floor. I really should. Oh, I could have got it. We really should do the ones up here as well. I fell. Okay, yeah, there is. I should be able to get in here. Really cool that the glowstone lights up when it's just in your hand. That is quite cool. Like you could go caving with a torch and it would uh, it would always be lit up. Ugh. Okay, I think guys, I know it's a bit of a different episode, uh, but I think you guys get the idea. I don't want to uh, bore you completely to death. I know a lot of you will actually be like me and find this crazy fun and, and like seeing it all change. But I also know that some of you won't. Uh, some of you won't like this and, uh, and will find it a little bit boring. But we've actually got 
a pretty big chunk of the city done, to be fair. Oh, we'll just hit those last those last ones there. But uh, yeah, I mean, it makes a huge difference to me when I'm when I'm flying around and you can see all of these like little parts lit up. <laughs> the street lights all help with that sort of uh, feeling. But I mean, look, what a huge difference! Like all down here now is all lit up. That was never lit up before. So much life, and in the daytime, it makes no difference. Like like it doesn't affect the shaders in a bad way or anything like that. Um, when you when you're on the outside, it just it, it's only it's only positive. When you come to doing an actual interior, like if we if we come and do an actual interior in here one day, um, it's not like the glowstone is going to ruin it. I just take it off and I put my own proper lighting in. And suddenly you've got uh, probably an even more natural looking one. Oh, really cool gates on this one. Yeah, through there. Huge house again. That's not a window up top. there and there even doing it on the back side like that's got trees like pressed up against it but you might be able to see the little glow come through uh the leaves or something so uh i, I do it anyway uh car rental will be open as well at this time still be open wouldn't it 24 hours i'll do them all it's only three windows beautiful really happy might also try and get some lights on zono wood soon as well that would be a good idea but yeah let's just fly back over where we've done this episode let's turn the, the hat off there so the farmhouse is all lit up the university is all lit up the little like nighttime dorms or, or, or maybe experiments late at night doing coursework oh i should really do the um observatory as well let's just hit that quickly Oh, I did. I did do it. Just couldn't see it from the angle. Yeah, I did do it. Just not from the angle that we were at. I don't think I've done this side, though. There's only, like, three windows in here. There we go. Yeah, you've got little lights down there. Lights around all of this area now. I think all of the restaurants and stuff are all lit up as we need. The arcade, Rainbow Row, obviously. See right out in the distance there now with all the lights. What are those lights? Is that inside the cathedral? Must be inside the cathedral, right? There's some weird lights going on there. Yeah, it must be the cathedral. Yeah, 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 it is. Weird how they work like that. What is that down there then? Oh, that's inside the um, mechanic. Yeah, got it. Right, that is going to do it then for this episode, guys. We'll have to do this again soon. That's a huge chunk of the world actually done. The next one, I mean, the skyscrapers. I mean, the skyscrapers have to be done. They'll take forever. But can you imagine, like, with, like, a load of the lights lit up on there? Just amazing all around here. It would be sick. It would be sick. Oh, and last episode, I know I said that I was going to go to the um, the football stadium and then I sort of, sort of forgot. <laughs> so, uh, here's a quick look at the football stadium for any of the, uh, the new subscribers that want to see it. We've got, like, the little TV cameras up in the sky. Uh, time set 7,000. Yeah, little TV ones. Score up there. Little Creeper logo. ZFC, Zono FC. Little racetrack running around the outside of it. And we can actually swap out the interior. For those of you that don't know. We can we can hit a command. And, and we can swap out to a monster track rally. Uh, I think an olympic -y style one. Um, horse racing? Maybe even a horse racing one. I can't remember. Uh, but yeah. We can we can actually just re redo the entire uh, bottom skim. Uh, skim list. Yeah, basketball, blank, uh, football, ice hockey, monster, Quidditch was the other one, cool one that we done. So we can just load them in. I think I stand at the middle, but I'm I'm a little bit scared to uh, to do it. 
<laughs> we'll do it another time when I've got time to fix it if I completely break it. If you guys enjoyed the episode, hit that like button. If you haven't already, then feel free to subscribe. We shall see you in the next episode.